Whoa, 83% of you watching right now aren't subscribed. I'd be really grateful if you did. What is up, people? Tensa here, and today I'm back with our United Storm and Wild video. And today, I am proud to present Big Shaman. You may have heard of this deck before. It utilizes Overlord mechanics to push out really big minions such as Scrapyard Colossus or Yasharaj to take over the game very quickly. With all the quest decks running around, the burst potential of this deck, just getting out huge minions really quickly, is really important. Now, with all the board clears and healing, we do have a good amount of survivability in the deck to let us go and try and build up those combos. But yeah, that's the deck. You just want to slam big minions. So without further ado, let's get into those games. How's it going, Garrosh? I'm excited to try out against more aggro because I think this deck has legs against aggro. Uh, I'm going to drop. I'm going to drop overdraft. We just want to find a way to put this down on the board. Lightning Storm will become very useful, especially against Pirate Warrior. Um, because this can... Unless they play uh, the buff, the 3-3 three, three buff dude, um, it should clear most boards. Not all boards, but most most pirate boards. They've been running um, some more big stat and minions lately. And then there's always the sword biter, sword eater dude. Cool, so we're looking for like our Eurekas, our Ancestral Calls. Perpetual Flame is also great. It is, yeah. When I was looking at this list, um, like, Ancestral Spirit, <laughs> it's actually incredible with the Scrapyard Colossus. I'm just thinking, there's so many board clears in this list. They're gonna come in handy against against this meta. I think her deck just automatically has an advantage most of the time against, um, that is a little, little annoying. Oh, wow. Uh, lucky for us, we have this, but uh, I think I'm going to let the board chill for a bit. Uh, we also have Perpetual Flame that can clear everything that we need. Do I portal? I don't think I do. I, I'll be curious to see if they, <laughs> if they try and hit into this. Coin. Skycrag, okay. I think it is actually worth clearing this board now. Lightning Storm. Um, I think I'll Perpetual Flame just because it's going to get more, uh, it's going to overload me more. So I want to use all my overload stuff now. Yeah. Since I probably, probably not going to do too much next turn i'll just use all my overload now save it up and if we draw an overdraft that we really want to use i can always just lightning bloom for it Done. cool landslide yeah no worries we're just playing it cool playing it cool Ship's cannon. They're setting up and we got another response. <laughs> Freebooter. Interesting that they did that when they have a weapon in hand, but. Walking Fountain. We're getting to the point where we can actually start playing these. We can actually play that now if we want to. And I think I do. Why not? That's what I say. Cool. We just got back to, uh, we gained all of our life back. <laughs> that was exactly eight. That's what we needed. And if we get another, um, if this doesn't die, we can also, uh, Ancestral Spirit. Though I would rather Ancestral Spirit our Scrap our Colossus. Because this will seal out the game. Uh, this probably won't. Let's see what they got. Slamburger, come on. Cool. Oh, it would be cool if this didn't kill our fountain. Okay. That's fine by me. We still have <laughs> three board clears and one <laughs> direct damage spell in hand. That's wild. Oh, we, we do, we do, um, have to 
make sure we figure stuff out before Rokara comes down. Uh, or have a plan when Rokara is down. I think I will. I will play this. So we have something. Cool. Just so we have something on the board. Because Rokara is a threat that will be impending. Oh, Whack-A-Mole is quite good. Cool. And nice that they don't have Rokara this turn. Cool. Overdraft is pretty good. I think I will have to send it back, unfortunately. Ancestral Call is really good. Oh, and that gets... That gets their... Oh. And then we can Ancestral Call. Oh! <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so brutal! That's so brutal! That's so brutal! Bye bye! <laughs> wow, well played! Jeez! How's it going, Zyrella? So, at the end of the day, I mean, no matter what deck it is, if we get the right opener, like we can, even if this is aggro priest, if we have the right opener, then we're chilling. <laughs> I think I'll keep landslide. Um, no, you know what? We're just gonna go for we're just gonna go for big minions. We have so many board clears in our deck that I just kind of want to try and find ways to um, get this going. Greetings, cool. Ooh, and they have a diamond reliquary. Interesting. Not seen that ran before. There is ancestors call. So I'm just gonna pass now, but. That means that we are looking for a big minion. Shadow cloth needle, not really a concern. Healing rain, cool. We're just gonna drop this ancestral. Cool. Something like uh, Yasharaj is definitely the best pull uh, off the top, but just about anything else would be really good as well. Cool. Far sight. Yeah, that's not what we're looking for. Might go. Might have to coin Hagatha's scheme. Um, cool. Overdraft. That's pretty good as well. I think I'll just call in Haggard of the Scheme here. Unfortunate that we have to do it like that, but we have to deal with the board. And then next turn, I think I'll go ahead and Farsight. It'd be nice to save this overdraft for after we Lightning Bloom and stuff, but uh, we might have to use it for the trade, trade value. Ooh, that's quite good. Cool. Okay, so we rip a Morgue Fiend. Something I will actually... Hmm. I think we go ahead and overdraft. Or I could Healing Rain. Hmm. Because I could... Do this, Lightning Bloom, Healing Rain. I think that's probably the best. This. Cool. Oh, wow. Oh, okay, okay. It's just the Reliquary. I thought it was, um, <laughs> for a second, I thought it was the big boy. Cool. Sweet. So, for some reason, I thought this had Taunt and Divine Shield. 
ship's cannon. That is kind of annoying. Though it is good that we uh, healing rained. wonder if they kill it. They probably do. I mean, they have to, right? <laughs> it's not, uh, not a question, I guess. Well, I guess technically if they had enough burn, they could wait. Yeah. Interesting. This uh, landslide will end up being good, I think. There are a couple things that would be better, though. Yeah, we have... We have some board clears that would be better. Perpetual flame. Like perpetual flame. Wow. So... Guess I'm gonna go ahead and do this. <laughs> cool. Then I'll go ahead and shoot here for quite a bit. Then I'm gonna far side. <laughs> and another land. Cool. Sweet. Well, <laughs> this game took a good direction. When I was looking at this list the first time, I was like, man. That is a lot of board clears. Like, I don't know how, how much we'll need all of those, but lo and behold, they all came in handy. They all came in handy. I mean, we used the Hagatha Scheme and that Perpetual Flame, and if they start building out a board again, we're probably going to have to use these landslides too. Nas Dormu. Okay. <laughs> cool. Ancestors Call. All enemy minions. Cool. Ha! <laughs> That's lethal. <laughs> well played, opponent. <laughs> well played.